In this video we're going to look at the new Tesco 7 inch Huddle tablet and show you just how versatile and useful it can be. First off there's a micro USB port at the bottom of the Huddle for recharging the battery. A micro USB cable is included in the pack. But you can also use this cable for file transfers between a PC and your Huddle. Setup is dead easy and automatic. You can see all your Huddle files on your PC almost immediately. And if you have a micro SD memory card fitted in your Huddle, that will appear as a separate drive. Copying, moving or deleting files is as easy as it is on your own PC. If you already use a USB memory stick like this for carrying data around, you can connect it to your Huddle's micro USB port with an OTG cable like this. You can also use this setup to connect other devices, such as a digital camera or a keyboard. There's Bluetooth on board as well, so you can link your Huddle up to devices such as external speakers, headphones and printers. Switch Bluetooth on in settings and then connect up to the de desired device in the Bluetooth list. The Huddle has a 7 inch size screen which has an excellent resolution of 1440 by 900 pixels. But anticipating you might want to plug your Huddle into a high definition TV for better viewing. The Huddle also has an HDMI socket at the top. But you'll need to buy a micro HDMI cable for this. You should be able to get one for about 5 to £10. Pounds. Setup is very simple. Plug in the cable. Switch on your Huddle HDMI in Settings HDMI. Find the right channel on your TV and that's it. Crystal clear videos, photos, web pages, TV channels or games on your HD TV. If you need to, you can adjust the output resolution in Huddle HDMI settings and adjust the size of the picture on your TV. You can also set the Huddle screen to shut off after a range of times, preserving the battery. There's even a wireless display option, so if your TV can handle it or you have a wireless display adapter fitted, you might not even need an HDMI cable at all. There is a built-in 16 gigabytes of memory, which is pretty good. But if you've got a lot of music or videos, they will eat all that up. Unlike most of the low price competitors, the Huddle has a micro SD slot for a further 32 gigabytes of memory. Fitting a micro SD card can be a bit fiddly. Just make sure your Huddle is switched off when you push the card right in. As we said, when your Huddle is connected to a PC via its USB cable, the micro SD card appears as a separate drive. You can also use your Huddle to access files on your PC through your local Wi-Fi network. If you download an app such as ES File Explorer, you can stream music, photos and video files directly from your PC to your Huddle wherever you are, in your home or office, without actually having to download them. Finish the job by connecting your Huddle via its HDMI port to a high definition TV and you have a really impressive media centre. Better still, ES File Explorer can also handle files in cloud storage, such as Dropbox. So you can download or stream files to your Huddle without even needing a PC at all. Add some more of the best Android apps for the Huddle. And you've got a great versatile tablet for a bargain price. But what about if you're in a place where you can't get Wi-Fi? We'll show you how to get around this problem in the next video. In the meantime, thanks for watching.